Hey man, let me have my coffee here. Hang on, man. Hang on. Hey, one more thing. Let me some coffee. Uh, by the way, the young rascal is grooving. Oh man, there's nothing like a good cup of coffee in the morning, right? Especially after sex with yourself. Huh. Good morning, good morning, good morning, Henry. How we doing, Irving Ordiales? Good morning, good morning, good morning. Going live here in about 20 seconds. Ah. You're probably going, Robert, where's the Pandusa, Robert? Where's the Taquito, Robert? Um, I don't have anything. Nobody's brought me anything. That's what happens when you're single. Nobody brings you nothing. <laughs> right, right. Mas triste. Here we go. There we go. Something by the young rascals grooving. Eight o'clock in the morning. Good morning. Double R Radio. June the 27th. Those means yes, you ought to. Wednesday morning. Hump day Wednesday it is. Ow. Um. <sighs> got my cup of coffee earlier. Usually I don't get my cup of coffee till about 8.30, 9 o'clock, but I needed some coffee, man. I really did. I don't know, man. I'm struggling a little bit uh, this morning, actually, and the reason why is porque yesterday evening I went out for some brewskis with my buddy, Mr. Raul Perales, and uh, we're going to be talking more about him here in the next uh, hour, but anyway, just, uh, we got together for some drinks, and we're talking and laughing, and just had a really, really good time, man. Really, really awesome to meet up with, um, actually, he is my legal advisor, my lawyer, Mr. Raul Perales, and, uh, just really, really just had a good time, man. Really did. You know, drank about three or four pitchers of beer. And then from there, we took a couple of shots. And there you go. And even more so, the place had a little botana. Just in case you don't know what a botana is, a botana is when they put a little bit of food, like little knickknack foods, like crispy tacos and uh, chips and salsa. You know, botana. Something just to have to eat some papa. And, uh, well, I got to tell you, man, it was good. It was really, really good. Heck, man, I didn't get home till 10 o'clock. Said, man, what the hell, really? Um, ow! My coffee's very, very good. Let's do some good morning shout outs and let's talk a little bit. Here we go. Good morning shout out. Good up to Henry Torres. Good morning, Henry. How we doing? Irby Ordiales. Buenos dias, buenos dias, buenos dias. Patty Zap. Go Spurs, go. Good morning. There we go. Henry Torres says, Good morning, Robert Henry from Lubbock, Texas, in the Casa. It's hot. It's, it is, man. These days are getting hot and more hot and more hot. They really, really are. Anyways, just uh, uh, good morning, Henry. Lubbock, Texas, in the Casa. Brenda Petlesky, uh, Overton. Good morning, good morning, good morning. There we go. Juan Rosas, how you doing, Juan? Carlos J. Luisa Salazar, buenos dias, buenos dias. Orlando Herrera, good morning. Irma Medina, good morning. Cynthia Gonzalez Ramirez, Houston, Texas. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Cindy Snyder, smile, Cindy. Good morning, Cindy. Anyways, uh, there we go. Robert Brown the third. How you doing, Robert? Anyways, El Tocayo. Robert, by the way, whenever um, Hispanics have the same name, they call each other Tocayo, which means we got the same name. Hey, que paso, Tocayo? Tocayo. Why? I don't know. It's just getting the way it is. Good morning, shout out to Tony Gloria. Guerrero the third as well. There we go. A lot of thirds in the house today. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Anyways, let's see what's going on out here in our crazy... Check this out, man. I couldn't believe this. Did y'all know that police are teaching dogs how to perform CPR? <laughs> are you serious? <laughs> I can't imagine being thrown on the pavement, you know, you know, passed out, whatever, heat exhaustion, and the police goes... Okay, Fido, go perform CPR. <laughs> and here comes this dog performing CPR on me. I don't think so. Get away, stupid dog. <laughs> really, man, I'm making this up. Police are teaching dogs how to perform CPR. I don't think so. It's not going to happen to me. I'm going to say, go ahead and let me die. It's over with. Good morning, Jed. I get up to Christina Garza. Good morning. Uh, there we go. B. Camarillo. Buenos dias, buenos dias. Uh, Jen Cod uh, Cadillo. Cadillo? Did I get that right? Good morning, good morning, good morning. So anyway, dogs are being, t uh, dogs are being taught how to perform CPR. Um, I can't even... <laughs> I can't even... And you're probably going, well, Robert, um, what style are the dogs learning how to perform CPR? 
uh, doggy style. Uh, there you go. Uh, anyways, <laughs> wait a minute. Hey. Ow! My coffee's very, very good this morning. So, so much about them dogs. Now, check this out. A woman's outburst on a spirit flight from Houston uh, caused a plane to be diverted to, um, where'd they go to? Um, well, let's get to the story. Here's the deal. A woman was taking off a Spirit Airlines flight from Houston after she had a mid-flight meltdown. Anyways, a video was posted on, on, on throughout the internet. It was a 20-second video of the woman cursing and making threats involving her brothers and just yelling and screaming and all this other good stuff. Well, the plane had to be diverted from one place to the other just so that they could get her ass off the plane. You know, here's the deal. These people, man, I mean, they're so, I mean, por favor, man, keep your drama, keep everything off the plane. Get the hell off the plane, then you can do whatever you want. But this woman went and started laying some F words and screw you and F yours and all this other good stuff, yelling and screaming on the plane. So the plane had to be diverted. And the plane started in Houston and, uh, well, it had to be diverted to Kansas just to get rid of her. Well, anyways, just when they landed in Kansas, uh, security service showed up and they had to get her off the plane. How crazy is that, right, to go bonkers on a plane? I don't think so. Good morning, John Argonata. Nancy Hernandez. Good morning, Ernesto Tejeda Trevino. How you doing, amigo? Good morning, brother. There we go. Let me see here. Deborah Camarillo, Anaheim, California. Buenos dias. Connie Villarreal. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Christina Garza says, good morning, Robert. Have a blessed hump day. I'm going to try, Christina. Good morning. And the same to you. There we go. Loretta McCarthy. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Christina Garza. Good morning, good morning, good morning. You know, um... Yesterday, I was doing my Uber thing. I was in downtown San Antonio, and um, I saw <laughs> I saw something that really, really made me crack up. And I posted it, and people got mad at me for posting this, but it made me laugh because of the way he was doing it. I saw a homeless man. This is all true. I saw a homeless man. He was talking to a pigeon, <laughs> but not like "Come here, little pigeon, come here." No, and it wasn't like he was going. Oh. No, he wasn't doing that either. I do that to a girl in the middle of the night. Ooh, and they like it. No, but really, this this homeless man, he was talking to a pigeon, and he was just kind of like getting after it. Like, look here, stupid pigeon. Get the hell out of the way. Kind of like that, you know. He was like really telling off the pigeon, right? He really was. And the pigeon was kind of like looking at him like, What's your problem? But really, man, <laughs> I thought it was so funny, man. I started cracking up, but this homeless man, he kept on, like, cursing at him, and he's sorry, mother, and telling him this and telling him that, and the pigeon just kept on looking at him, like, what are you talking about, right? So I posted this on Facebook about a homeless man talking to a pigeon, and everybody got after me saying, don't be making fun of homeless people talking to pigeons. So from here on out, um, I will never talk about homeless people talking to animals until tomorrow. And then I'll get back on it again today. So there you go. Hey, man, it was funny. <laughs> I thought it was very, 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 very funny. Good morning, Chad. I got it to Maria Flores. Good morning, Maria. How we doing? Cecilia, Leal, Hernandez. Good morning. Maravilla's very only warrior, Basil. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Angel and Gibby, Villarreal. Hondo, Texas in the house. There we go. Good morning, Hondo, Texas. Anyways, I tell you what, it is Wednesday morning. I'm hungry. You know, I went to this bar yesterday, me and my buddy, and they put a botana out there. They had um, crispy tacos. They had, uh, what else did they put out there? It was crispy tacos. They had nacho cheese. They had, um, they put some kind of peach cobbler out there. And I mean, they had some food at this bar. And I go, man, I'm, I'm going to quit cooking and I'll just go to the bar seven days a week and eat there. I'll eat for free. Nothing wrong with that, right? Anyways, I tell you what, let's get back to the morning show. Let's keep it going. Let's just tell you bye. Your worlds and people. Don't stop the music. It is. What time is it? Uh, 8.08 in the morning. When was he asked? Double R Radio. You know, um, radio stations are going. There we go. There we go. Okay, we're good to go. Um, yesterday, little one-on-one -on -one action here. I almost got a ticket yesterday. I did nothing wrong. I was trying to pick up an Uber passenger, and I was looking for them. I was going really, really slow, and this cop was following me, man. <laughs> and I said, man, these cops, don't they have anything else better to do? Jeez. And it, I got a little nervous. I'm not going to lie to you, but, um, he kind of like went around me and kept on going about his business, but I got nervous there, man. When a cop follows you, it makes me nervous. <laughs> it does, man. You know, those cops are kind of, and I was looking at my rearview mirror like, holy shit, did I pay my bill? 
You know, did I pay my parking ticket? <laughs> what does he want? Leave me alone. And eventually he did. And there you go. Let's get back to the morning show. Join me, robertrevasradio.com. Just click on the blue button. I'll say it one more time. Join me, robertrevasradio.com. Click on the blue button. And you'll be joining me live. Morning show time.